Hey guys, what's up? It's Charlie here, and today we're going to be looking at the 8 best life hacks and crafts. In case you guys didn't know, I have a whole different brand called The Crafty. It has over a million Instagram followers, so maybe you know it. Well, on that, I do a bunch of life hacks and crafts, and today I'm going to be testing some of these out on top 10s. But before we make our lives way easier, why not subscribe and press the notification bell too? Coming up first, we have Oreo Ice Pop. Do you guys love Oreos? I'm sure you do, but it's coming up to the summertime, so maybe it's a bit too hot for Oreos, no? Well, don't worry about it, guys, because today we're making an Oreo Ice Pop. All you need to do is grab one of these Oreo boxes, which has individual packets of Oreo cookies. Then take one out, and here's the fun part. Smash it with a rolling pin. Just imagine the Oreo packet someone you don't like, and really smash it to pieces. Then open it up and stand it in a glass. Next, pour in some double cream. This may be called heavy cream if you're in America, and if you don't have that, try using milk. But be warned, milk does not freeze as well as heavy cream, so try that instead. Now for the hard part, we have to wait for it to freeze. Simply put it in the freezer for around 4 hours and it should be ready to enjoy. Now take it out of the freezer and have a delicious bite of these Oreo Ice Pops. This is great to make in the summer and is very cheap and easy too. Next up is DIY Stress Ball. I'm sure no matter what you do, you're stressed out. Maybe you've got a really tough job and you get stressed out with all the work you have to do. Or maybe you're a teenager going through high school and you have personal issues and high school issues. Well, did you know that therapists say one of the best things to do is to squeeze a stress ball? It may sound silly, but squeezing a stress ball really can help to relieve your stress. But who wants to buy a super expensive one? Instead, let's make our own for free. First, grab a water bottle and fill it up with flour. Next, grab a balloon and put that over the bottle. Now turn the bottle on its side and squeeze the flour into the balloon. Try not to make too much mess, but be warned, this hack is kind of messy. Once you've got all the flour in the balloon, take the balloon off the water bottle. Next, tie the balloon up and try not to get too much flour all over the place. And there you go, you've got your own DIY stress ball made easy. You can squeeze this as much as you want and it shouldn't break. If you want some extra fun, draw a smiley face on it with permanent marker. Next up is keyboard cleaning slime. Look at your computer keyboard right now. I guarantee there's some nasty dirt or grime on it somewhere. Okay, maybe that's just me, but if you can relate to, then don't worry, we're gonna clean that up right now. And we can do it all with the magic of slime. For this one, you need to grab a bowl, then dump a bunch of clear or white PVA school glue into it. Next up, add some lemon juice to create a clean lemon scent. Then for fun, you can even add some food coloring. Then add borax or eye contact solution to it. Now we need to mix it up a lot. You should mix it until it's around the consistency you're seeing on screen right now. Make sure it's not too sticky, otherwise it will get stuck inside your keyboard, which will not be good. Once it's at this kind of texture, you can dump it onto your keyboard. Let it sit for a few seconds and it should pick up any dirt or grime on your keyboard. This one may take a few tries to make sure you have it the correct consistency. But once you have, you can store it in a plastic container and use it every time your keyboard gets dirty. Next up is Balloon Magic Trick. If I asked you to pick up a glass jar or cup with just a balloon, you'd probably say how. Well, it's easy with this amazing magic trick. First, grab your jar or glass. Then, light a match and put it into the glass. Now, quickly before it goes out, put your balloon over the glass or jar. Then, wait for the match to go out and it will stick to the balloon. You'll now be able to raise the balloon and it will raise the glass or jar. And if you try to pull the two apart, you probably won't be able to unless you're very strong. The way this works is the lit match needs oxygen. That's why it sucks all the oxygen out from the gaps in between the balloon and the jar. This presses the balloon into the jar, making it stuck in there. But don't worry, if you need your jar or glass back, simply grab a pin and pop that balloon. Next up is Balloon Ice Hack. We've all been there. You're at a house party and you have a load of drinks in ice. But the ice melts very quickly and before you know it, all of your drinks are simply floating in water. Well, here's a way to make ice that stays frozen for a very long time. And not only that, you can actually reuse this ice. All you need to do is grab a bunch of balloons. Then fill them up with a bit of water and then freeze them. Once they're frozen, you can put them in a bowl and then put a bunch of drinks in there too. Then just like that, you have reusable ice for any party or event. And because these balls of ice are so large and thick, it means they won't melt after a very long time. Next up is elastic band hack. 
So this one is a super simple hack you can use every single day. Have you ever tried to get some powder from a container and taken way too much? We've all been there whether we're making coffee or hot cocoa. But to fix this, all you need to do is put an elastic band around the container. You can then scoop out however much you want and simply brush the excess amount off with the elastic band. This is super easy to do and it's a hack you can use every single day. And finally on the list of our best life hacks and crafts, we have clean permanent marker. If you're in school or work, I'm sure you make notes on your hands all the time. But what happens if you use a permanent marker? Or maybe if your friend pranks you and draws permanent marker on your hand? Well, there's actually a really weird way to clean it off you wouldn't imagine. First, you need to grab an unlit match. Then dip that in some water. Then brush that on your hand and it will actually get rid of permanent marker. This is a pretty amazing cleaning tip which works wonderfully. So there you go guys, those were our best life hacks and crafts. If you want more like this then be sure to leave a comment down below and I'll be sure to make some more. And remember guys, you can find way more of my life hacks and crafts on my other brand The Crafty. It's pretty big on Instagram but not as big on Facebook and YouTube so be sure to follow it on there too. And be sure to check out the poll in the top right corner to vote for the best life hack on this list. But as always, thanks for watching. Check out some more videos on screen right now. Leave a like if you enjoyed. And if you haven't already, what are you waiting for? Subscribe to Top 10s.